Hey y'all, it's Caddy Bo. I am out here in the EBR, y'all. I know, I got quilts behind me because I don't have doors on those shelves, y'all. So we cover them with quilts. Um, I'm just opening up my iPad. And yes, I sound like I'm a little under the weather. And I am. There we go. Okay, all right. Um, yeah, so I don't know if you were here the other day, but somebody's got cooties. Me and Ninja Man. Um, we have COVID. We do. Hey, whoever's on, come say hey, hey. We have COVID. Um, but y'all, I'm just, we're going to talk about COVID for just a minute. Okay? Okay, okay. Here we go. Hold on. I'm trying to get things in order. I'll be very honest. I wasn't doing nairn until I had to. Okay. Hey, Karen. Hey, Michelle. Hey, Kathy Vernon. Thank you all for being here. Okay, we're just going to talk about COVID for just a minute. Oh, Kathy, thank you. We are actually feeling better, but we're still cruddy. Okay, okay, let me just show you. This is the home test. Hi, Lindell. And this is not your grandma's COVID, okay? This isn't the 2020 COVID. This COVID, it's, it's like the flu. It's like the flu, y'all. Um, and I think we've been, we've been programmed. I'm trying to hold it still. Hold on. Okay. See that little second line there? That means you got the cooties. That's what that means. The cooties. Okay. Um, I really thought I wouldn't have to worry about that after fourth grade, but here we are. Um, yeah. So let me tell you what cooties brings. Um, uh, Oh, you had it in January. Yeah. And um, Lindell, Ray, hey, Lindell, Ray brought it back from Vegas. He was supposed to leave it in Vegas. Oh, you didn't get it. Good job. Yeah, we immediately sequestered Ninja Man. He went into the bedroom. We had a, we had a bona fide plan. And hey, Miles, I'm talking about my cooties, Miles. My cooties, okay? Yeah, but, but here's the thing. Ninja Man tested positive on Saturday. I test positive on Sunday. And we've been feeling really sorry for ourselves. And we wanted an adult supervision um, person, you know, to just come and do all of our biddings, everything. Like, I really want somebody to go to Wendy's. I do. I do. Now, I'll get a Frosty, but, you know, I'm type 2, y'all. Only because they don't have a type 10. <laughs> but, no, I'm type 2 diabetic. And I can't have the whole Frosty. But y'all, I can eat a little now and a little later. Anyway, so don't be saying I'm cute today either because we hadn't done nothing with this hair, all right? There's no makeup, but there never is. Y'all, I got my hair clip right here in the back because it's going on in just a minute, but y'all can't see it. Okay, here, here's what COVID is all about. Hey, Leanne, so due to the cooties, we had to get vitamin C two times a day, because we're old. I, oh, Michelle, I would let you, girl. Um, thank you, Lindell. I I feel better. I really do. I've just, oh, I got, I got things. To, okay, two times a day on the vitamin C, two times a day on the D, two times a day on the turmeric, 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 this thing, two times a day. Um, B100 complex. I I don't even know. I don't even know, but we're taking it. I've got a cough syrup here that is, you know, it's kind of like street legal or street unlegal, whatever. It, it knocks you on your butt. Why did they want us to have Prilosec? I have no idea. But we got a uh, Prilosec acid reducer. You have to dissolve it under your tongue. Thank you very much. And then um, Zycan, I, I don't even know. And then I've got prednisone, which is making me, you know, Oh, I know, homeopathic would, but we don't have, home, we, we have homeopathic doctors, but we don't have homeopathic med, uh, pocketbooks. Hey, Deborah. So, um, so yeah, so this is positive, but let me tell y'all some crazy, crazy things, all right? My sweet friend, um, my sweet friend is helping us by just sending me little bites of what the CDC says, okay? And, um... And I'm able to digest those little bites. Like, I can't go to the website and start looking at everything. Um, oh, the zinc. Yes, we're on zinc. Um, 
Did I show that? Anyway, we're on zinc. Um, oh, and then another, another, some kind of medicine that is specific to this Monta something there. I don't know. Anyway, so my friend is sending me these little bites, you know, and I'm going along with them. Well, I realized I have a doctor's appointment on Monday, um, just a, a standard appointment. So I sent them a note and said, hey, I got cooties, which they know. And they called me back and said, because I said, I don't know what to do about my appointment. And they said, if you're not running a fever, come on. And I'm like, but what if I'm not tested negative? Because I tested Sunday, I was positive. I tested today, I'm positive. She said, that doesn't matter. Really? Okay, okay. So she said, you're going to be, you're going to be testing positive for a while. As long as you don't have a fever, you're good to go. Okay. So the CDC is um, not getting political here, but I don't know who to believe, y'all. Anyway, so um, I don't have a fever. I don't, I don't, uh, Michelle Merriman, for months, um, you talking about uh, you were on antibiotics for months or are you talking about testing positive for months? So the nurse told me, you're going to test positive. You're going to have coughing and fatigue, but you're okay as long as you don't have a fever. Okay. Like I said, it's not your grandma's COVID. All right. This is not the COVID from 2020. Okay. Yeah. Um, oh, she said her husband po tested positive for at least three months. Yeah. We, we have to use our common sense, Lindell. And the only thing now, I've got a little head cold right here. Cooties. Cooties. And I'm craving a Wendy's burger. I mean, is that part of it? Is that part of it? Oh, yeah, Kathy, they're making it up as it goes. And I don't think they know. And if Joe Biden would not come over here, he wouldn't have called it. That's all I got to say. He'd been knocking on my door. I said, we got cooties. And he's like, that's all right. I'm presidential. So we let him in, let him pet on the dogs. And then he comes up with cooties. Not really. Not really. But he does have the cooties. Okay. Um, yeah, so I did. We have taste and smell. Um, yeah, Ninja Man has a little bitty job. I've got jobs that I work out of my home. Ninja Man has a little bitty job that he has to go into public, and uh, they told him the same thing. They told him the same. As long as you don't have a fever, bring it. Oh, okay, okay. Well, maybe that's how we can all keep getting it. All right, let's craft, okay? All right, so I just want y'all to see me because um, my selfie the other day, I took a selfie. And this is it. My friend Karen took my selfie for me. That was me. Okay. I'm going to put y'all up here and I will. I, <laughs> hold on. Hold on. I got to flip you too. All right. There you go. You're flipped. Y'all are flipped. And here I am still covering the, the thing. Hold everything. Let me see. I got to move you over. There we go. I think that'll do. That'll do. Now, I know I got a big old mess. Boop. Okay, y'all, y'all. This is what I started with. This is, do we want this on? Let me see. We may not. This is um, the, the Dollar Tree stretched canvas. Hold on, do I want that? Wait a minute. I might not. Nah. Hold on, y'all, hold on. Um, Dollar Tree, just canvas, okay? So I used that. Boop. Took the canvas off. We'll be doing something with this. And y'all, I'm using... Y'all ain't gonna believe how beautiful this stuff is. I gave y'all a little hint the other day. Look, look at my little test sitting here. Just, I think it's haunted. This test is haunted because every time I turn around, there it is. Okay. Um... <laughs> Okay, so this is Iron Orchid Designs, I-O-D, all right? Let me just tell y'all, I'm, I'm going to turn the light off because it's a little glary. I'm going to tell y'all, I love these vintage soft prints like this. Love them, okay? And let me see. I've got a lot of messages, most of it about COVID, so I'm going to skip those for right now. Um... 
<laughs> Karen says this retired nurse in fact inflectional control office officer is breaking out in a rash left eyes twitching I can't even I know I know okay 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 um all right so I've been waiting on something this amazing for so long y'all they are rub on transfers now I've I've marked them because they're the way I have to pick them up like this is on this page and I don't want to get oils from my skin or anything, right? So I just put these on so I could flip the pages easier and show you. I found out about these from Lizzie and Erin. That's L-I-Z-Z-Y and E-R-I-N. Y'all need to go log into Lizzie and Erin and love all the things. I'm telling you, I'm telling you. Erin um, is their main crafter. And, well, she's the owner, and she, y'all, the things that she makes. So, I found out about this through her. Uh-oh, here we go. Look at the roses, y'all. Look at the roses. This just, it makes me go, ha, ah, right here. That's what it makes me do, right there. And, y'all, I mean, it's beautiful. Everything, the lettering, the the little angelic baby, the roses, the it's got thorns on the roses. I mean, come on. And then we have this. Now, y'all, I have an old door. Uh, Kathy, it's my favorite one, the little, the little girl one, my very favorite one in this pack. Y'all, I have another book, but I have a door in my studio. But both of my doors are sliding barn door kind of things. And the one in my studio is an old door that had like a big old window in it. And we have put, um, we had to put a plastic insert where the window was. And then I put in some um, cloudy looking paper. Um, so let's see. Lindell, I can relate what. Oh. All right, I, I don't know. Um, anyway, so I've this door, it's got a little window in it, and I put the little cloudy paper on so you couldn't see through because the door goes to the bathroom. And then I put some Parisian things um, from my um, Silhouette or Cricut One vinyl, and it's, it, it's uh, actually French words for the bakery or something. But we all know it's not a bakery. It's a bat. It, we call it the Batmobile. It's a bathroom, y'all. But all of these pretty little decals like this, y'all, they're beautiful. And I love everything Paris. And I'm thinking I could do just a, you know, just a few little things and put them in that bathroom, you know, on the shelf. Here's some more. These are a little bigger. Look at that. Oh, Seed packets, y'all. Seed packets is beautiful. Oh, and here's anti-bilocious pills. I might need some of those. And some lemonade purgative de rouge. Okay, I need some of that, too. I don't even know what it means. Um, here's some tooth wash, you, uh, I guess. Um, yes, they're all rub-ons, Deborah. Wait till you see what's right here. Oh, my goodness. I can't stand it. All right, hold on, hold on. And here's some more seed packets, y'all. And you know, at Six Little Acres, where we live, we have a little garden now, so we need all the seed things, right? Here's some more seed packets. Well, this says perfume. Um, y'all, I'm just, I am absolutely in love with this. But wait, there's more. Okay, I'm going to show you the other one. When I got this is the big one, and Erin has worked out of this that I've seen her do. Um, she may have the other one as well, but I know that she had this one. I got a sweet little message from um, the lady who who um, I bought it from. Um, her name is Lori, and she is at a company called Milton's Daughter, and that's who you would buy it directly from. Is Milton's Daughter? because Iron Orchid Design sells to her. So please do a screenshot here. Um, please tell her I sent you. Um, I'm hoping to um, to do a lot of business with her, but I don't know. I don't know that I will. It depends on how much I, I use these. 
Okay, so screenshot and we're done. One, two, and three. Okay, so y'all, this is the one that Aaron was working on when I fell deeply in love, okay? And they come with this little, this little plastic thing that, you know, it's a rub-on tool, right? Y'all see where I'm going with this, right? There's a bunny, there's a bird. Can y'all see it all? I hope so. It's a big one, y'all. It's a big one. All right, let me see how I can do this so you'll see everything. Oh, that should work right there. Um, so, keep in mind, you don't have to have a surface this big, right? And you don't do just this. You might just get this much of it. You know, just cut that much out. Um, here's a little mushroom. There's a strawberry. This is a beautiful flower right here. So, you can take small elements out of the bigger elements, okay? All right, look at the deer. Now, his expression looks like our puppy, Sir Winston Poops a lot. Hey, Suzanne, and hey, Robin. I'm so glad y'all are here. Y'all, these are rub-ons. These are rub-ons, and I'm going to show you the project I'm in the middle of in just a minute. I've already, I've already done a good bit, and we're going to do a little bit more while I'm, uh, while I'm live. Um, but here we go. Our little deer with the same face as our puppy, Sir Winston Poops a lot. And we got little flowers here and here. Got our little bird. I love the bird. And um, some flowers up here. Oh, look at the little hedgehog and the bunny and the bird. Y'all, I can't. I can't. I have to have these in my life. I need these on things that I see and enjoy every day. They need to be in my... This guy and this guy is the main reason I bought the the whole thing. Okay, another strawberry. So you could do a whole thing of strawberries. It's down here in the corner. I don't know if y'all saw it. Hold on, because the corner isn't showing up as well. There we go. Hey, girl. Hey, Suzanne. I, um, Suzanne, this is the um, Iron Orchid Designs, and you know, um, Aaron, I learned all of this from Aaron at Lizzie and Aaron. Um, this is the, um, oh, what's his name? I can't remember what he is. Uh, not a skunk. Maybe he's a skunk. Maybe he's a skunk. Yeah. If not, he's a cousin skunk, okay? Um, this pretty little bird right here. Now, you, y'all, the Iron Orchid designs, they're, they're saying you, you put these on furniture, you put them on what, whatever, you know, and you just rub them on to a clean surface, and then you uh, go over them, um, Go over the badger. Thank you, Susan. That's a badger. Um, you go over them with a with a finishing spray or something, and I haven't gotten that far. Okay, okay. Badger. Okay, here we go with the beautiful flowers, y'all. I mean, I gotta put my hair up. You remember that clip I showed you at the beginning? Yep, it's going up. Cause uh, Kathy Bow's crafting show is getting a little wamish in here. A little wamish. Okay, this is sweet as can be. I love his little face, the, the expressions on these animals. And look at this guy, Cousin Skunk. <laughs> it's a true story. He's Cousin Skunk. I, I had a Cousin Skunk. Anyway, um, here's a bird, and he's got a little crown, a little crown. Love it. Love all the little shrooms and the little flowers. And again, you can just take pieces and parts. But... Don't take pieces and parts of them because they're adorable. You got to use the whole thing, okay? I can't wait for y'all to see my project. Okay. Um, oh, we got the stump here that you can stick your frog on or your cousin skunk or your badger or your bird. And um, here's another crown right here. We'll flower down here, okay? All the mushrooms, just the wildlife stuff. You know, you know. And here we go with with some strawberries, and here's a pretty leaf, pretty flower. Um, you just you just got to use your imagination as to how you want all of this to go together. Okay, guess what? We're ready to show you what I'm working on, y'all. Okay, I used the Dollar Tree canvas like this, stretch canvas. I took the fabric off. Okay. So we're going to use this again later, I think. I'm not sure. 
Then I painted the, y'all, let's just have a moment of silence because this is beautiful. Okay. Can you even believe how pretty this is? I mean, it's just, y'all, it is just beautiful. All I did, I took a paintbrush and I went with the brown acrylic paint, okay? And I just scrubbed it on there and I was like, oh dear. You know me. I was going, oh dear, the whole time, right? Oh dear, oh dear. But y'all, it started working. It started, and I'm like, okay, all right. Then I came back with a um, chalk paint, this um, kind of a pewter color. Um, I could actually go get the paints if you wanted. But anyway, it's just like, it's all acrylic, okay? And then I just kind of buffed that on with what? A paper towel. Yes, because I didn't feel good, y'all. But I had to see this happen. So I took my paper towel and I dabbed it in my paint lid. Didn't even shake it up good. And I just scrubbed it on there, okay? And that's where you're seeing these streaks like this. And then I'm like, okay, well... We, we don't know how this is going to go. So then I started, I had, I'll be honest, I tried to do it before I took it out of the frame, okay? But no, when you go to, to scrubbing these things on, they want a hard surface underneath. It is not going to be playing with this whole moving canvas thing. No, it's not. No, you got to take it out, do the extra step, go the extra mile, don't do as I do, do as I say do, as my mama used to say. So I put it hard down on the table, and then I started scrubbing it on there. You know, ee, 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 ee. and this is what I got. Okay, but down here at the bottom, down here at the bottom, the little Nans and Nooner Incorporated Louisville, Kentucky was down here. And I'm like, oh, dear. And then I thought, but wait. Can we? Boop. Oh, we can. So we're gonna, y'all. Now, a real crafter, a real artist would probably tape this down. But let me tell you this. There's, it it kind of holds up. Happy about that, okay? It holds on. And here we go. I'm just going to, and I know the table's probably going to be shaken. Oh, oh. Looks like I paused. Okay, hold on, hold on. What's going on here? There we go. Okay, hey, Susan, I'm so glad you're here. For some reason, for some reason, we are, we are paused. Okay, it looks like we're back. Are we back, y'all? I hope we're back. I'm gonna, I'm gonna refresh over here right quick and make sure we're back. Oh, dear. I'm going to refresh and make sure we're back. We are. Okay, okay. I'm sorry, y'all. I'm a few seconds behind you. So um, whatever happens, I don't find out till after y'all do. Okay, so um, I hope that um, everybody heard me say hello to the latest ones that have jumped on. So, okay, I'm just, I'm just rubbing these on. And it's just like it was back in the day, y'all, except these are beautiful. And I have been waiting years for something this beautiful. And um, I do wish y'all would go to miltonsdaughter.com. Look at Iron Orchid Designs. She sells a lot of products there. But the Iron Orchid, y'all, is what these are. And um, I do wish y'all would go over there and, and enjoy looking at the page and if you buy anything just let her know I sent you even though um you know I'm not a I'm not an affiliate or anything but um but I am a new customer and uh I've talked to her via email a little bit and um I just like her to know that I shared you that I shared her because she's super sweet y'all and I mean even sent a thank you note now you know what I love to support small business. Now look, I'm picking it up just a wee bit and I see there's a teeny tiny right there. I don't even think it matters, but it belongs with the rest of its family, right? So I'm putting it down there and now I'm just gently lifting. Need some more work on the end. 
And y'all, even though I have COVID right now, oh good, thank you, Suzanne. And I hope you heard me say welcome. I'm so glad you're here. Um, so y'all, even though I have COVID, I mean, I'm okay. I'm okay. I'm okay. I just want it. I just, I don't know. I just want it to be gone. I'm ready to, to go places and do things. But I'll tell you this, I took a shower this morning. And every time I take a shower, I have to go rest. <laughs> All right, here we go. I'm just picking it. Oh, oh, we got a little piece right here. Y'all, this is absolutely beautiful. All right, I want to get just a little more on this E right here. A little more right here. There we go. Okay. And I want y'all to know there's there's not this big edge around everything. I mean, look how precise and beautiful this is. And it's y'all, it's a piece of art, and all I did was scrub a doodle doo. That's all I did. All I did. And look at it. Oh my goodness. Okay, so what I'll end up doing is putting this back on the back on the thing of a thing. And finishing the edges, I'm probably going to paint the edges brown and probably um, staple it back down. Now, I could finish this off, paint this, and then do like that, but I'm going to lose part of my design. Ain't nobody going to do that because it's all too pretty. I could also get a bigger frame and just put it in a bigger frame. So, I'm deciding because this is going to go in my house. I'm getting rid of a lot of the decor I have right now because, um, I don't know, I think 2020 got the best of me, and um, <laughs> I put up some pretty unusual things, but I think I want to go a little a little more grown up, I think. I don't know. Maybe. All right, y'all, we're going to do another one. I got these little books. I have no idea how this is going to go. This is from Michael's. And... This may or may not work. Y'all know. Y'all know. Kathy Bowes Crafting Show. Anything goes, right? Hey, we we do what we can do. This has been in my cl uh, closet. Clabnet. Cabinet. It's a cabinet. It's not a closet. It's a cabinet. For many, many years. It is a four-page linen-covered uh, cardboardish kind of a book thing. Okay? Okay. And all you do is you make a little book out of it, and you put the little rings on, and boom, you're done. Okay? So we're just, I'm, I'm actually going to use some that are not my very favorites, just in case, you know, just in case it gets a little crazy. So I want to start with, let's pick out our design. I'm going to go, I'm going to go over here and look at these little guys. Um, kind of think I might do the, the mushrooms, because... I mean, they're cute, but I'm not sure. It, look how it looks on furniture, y'all, here and here. Um, I'm not sure that I love mushrooms, so I think I'm going to do a mushroom or two. I don't know. Here's one. Boom. Just like that. How about it? How about it? Okay. Let's see if there's one on the front. Yes, there's one right here. Oh, let's see. And each of these big pages tear off. Yeah, I'm going to do this mushroom first, and then that little one, I think. Um, let me turn on my fan. It's it's heating up in here. It is heating up in the EBR, Kathy Bowes alternate studio. The EBR, the emotional baggage room. Um, when I was growing up, they called it a rumpus room, but I don't think we're allowed to rumpus anymore. Certainly not at my age. Hey, Sandy Palmer. Hey, Lindell. I probably already had, had said hi to y'all, but here's the story. This medicine we're taking, <laughs> it just, I mean, I'm not going to say it makes me goofy because y'all wouldn't be able to tell, but um, I'm telling y'all, it. <laughs> I'm a little forgetful, a little bit forgetful. Okay, so we're just, I'm just going to see if we can do it on this surface. This is like a linen kind of a canvas. It's a, what am I saying? It's canvas, 
but it's got a um, texture to it, not like this canvas. Okay, okay, okay. But first, I want to give it some color, some color. Okay, now if you saw my live on uh, Tuesday, you will find that I have been collecting the uh, Tim Holtz Ranger Distress Ink Little Bitty Minis, okay? And I keep them in a box of chocolates, um, and there's no chocolate. And I can't say where the chocolate went, but that's, that's the truth, and I'm sticking to it. Okay, I'm going to use this one. And then, if y'all saw me on Tuesday, you saw that I also bought a few more of these. So now I'm going to try and, oh dear, here we go. Oh wait, there's more. Wait, here, here's another one. Okay, we're gonna put a few colors together just to see if we can, okay? I think this one and this one, I, I think this is our color palette, y'all. I think, let's see. Hmm, I don't know now. I don't know. Um, and yes, they all say $6, which was a huge bargain. Got these at the scrapbook Expo. All right, all right, all right. I'm going to go with this one just because, okay? It's got some of the same colors as this little guy. Scrapbook Expo in Duluth, Georgia, and I had never been. And um, Deborah, you got a hot deal on distress inks from the Expo. You scored. Yes, ma'am, I did. I am so excited over, over that, that deal especially since I've been ordering like I was like I was Miss Got Rocks. I've been ordering stuff, y'all. Every day something new comes in, but that's the way it is. I think it was the COVID. I think that's what made me do it two weeks ago. <laughs> okay, y'all, here we go. So I'm just, I'm not even, you know, I'm not, I'm not even using a mat or anything. We're, we're just going. We are going with it. You know what? I kind of want to go like this, but I'm not. I'm not going to do it. Not going to do it. Come on now. Oh, look at there. We're going to get a little color on here. I hope. Maybe not. Maybe this wants, maybe this wants like some kind of. Oh, there. okay, y'all. We're doing this. We are doing this because now the color's coming on it, right? Oh, okay. Um,. So yeah, we're 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 gonna do this right now. We're just gonna scrub it on there. Forget the brushes. Now I gotta wash that one. Okay, okay. Here we go. All right, all right. I'm just gonna go. This one. Th there's gonna be one of these blocks that totally mess up everything. I bet you. But that's okay. That's all right. Like I said, this has been in my stash for years. This little this little book. This book, book. So, um, it's not like, you know, it's the cherished family heirloom book. It's not. We're just putting some color down. Um, I want some more of this pinkish color. You know, it doesn't look pretty here, but when I see it on here, it does. Oh, Lisa Ann. Hey, girl. Hey. Been too long. I'm doing some classes. I usually can't make it here. I am so glad to see you. I think, y'all, I'm I'm telling you, some of my girlfriends on here, I think we share some DNA, y'all. I do. I do, because we are so much alike. Okay. What have I done? Okay. <laughs> what have I done? Don't even try to answer that. All right. Here we go. We're, gonna, we're just going to throw some down and see. Oh, dear. Here we go. We're going to see what happens. Y'all want to know what colors I'm using? I do, too. Um, <laughs> maybe somebody will tell us. <laughs> All right. We have... Iced spruce. Mm -hmm. We have bundled sage. We're going to sage everything. Sage, sage. We have squeezed lemonade, tattered rose, and crushed olive. Now, crushed olive, I think, should go right about in here. There we go. How about it? Um, Do we want just a little more of this? I think so. There we go. All right. So we have a little, we have a little um, hot mess. That's what we have, just a little hot mess. And I think I want my book to flip this way. 
So, I don't know. I don't know, y'all. Th this may or may not work. Okay. Now, I do offer free parking. I did not hand out masks because of my COVID. Um, y'all should have brought a mask. But um, I, I cannot give any refunds be if this does not work. Okay. <laughs> ah. But y'all, I like I said, Ninja Man tested positive on Sunday. No, Saturday. I tested positive on Sunday. And we've just been... We've just been laying around feeling sorry for ourselves. We have. We have. I just wish um, wish we could. Uh, hold on. Hold on. Oh, dear. Oh, it may not do, y'all. It may not. This, this may not be the surface. We'll see. We're going to see. We're going to go this way. Then we're going to go this way. I'm kind of seeing there's a, you know, there is a grain in this in this fabric cover here. Come on, come on. Are you are you sticking down? Oh, you're trying. Okay, y'all. This may or may not ever work. We'll see. Yes, John Friday Me Saturday. Is that how we did it, Karen? I have no idea. That's right. We did <laughs> it was Friday and Saturday, Karen. Thank you. Y'all. If my friends do not carry my brain around, I would leave it at home all the time. Yes, he tested positive on Friday. I, pe pe I pested positive <laughs> on Saturday. Oh, my word. Okay, y'all. It's going to take too long because it is trying to stick. Oh, it is sticking. Hold on, hold on. Whoop, whoop. Hold everything. Because I can see it's coming off of the little plastic sheet. I can see when it leaves the plastic, okay? I think it just needed to know who is the boss. That's what I think it needed. I'm going to put this over here so y'all can enjoy um, seeing it while I'm working on this one because this this is... This is total success here, and this one's a hot mess. So we'll just we'll just do this. Leave it right there so y'all can see it and enjoy the beauty. Um, may need more pressure, Kathy Vernon says. I may, I may, I may. So y'all, I've been adding to cart. Um, Kathy, give me some ideas, Kathy Vernon. Give me some ideas how to get more pressure, even though I'm I'm pushing down harder for sure. And see, we're it's getting there. It's getting there. Um, but give me an idea how I would put more pressure on it. Um, so, y'all, I've been adding to cart. Okay, okay. I mean, Ninja Man knows, but I'm just saying. I've been adding to cart. So, the other day, my friend Heather and I were talking about planners. And I'm trying not to purchase a brand new planner until I can tell that I actually am using my planner, right? Because somebody in this household buys planners and loves them and works, you know, works them for, I don't know, anywhere from three or four hours to two or three months and then walks away from them and leaves the planner laying there sad and neglected. Look, y'all, it's coming. It's happening. Okay. Um, hey, Lori, apply the most pressure you can. It will stick. Have to really muscle it, though. Erin said she lifts as she goes. Yes. Now, that, Michelle, I'm glad you said that. And thank you, Lori. I'm, I'm going to do that. Okay, Michelle. Yes, Michelle Merriman just reminded me of this. When I did this one, y'all, it's that big sheet, right? couple of things. Number one, you probably want to tape it down, even though, you know, I didn't. Okay, so I rubbed on this much, and I mean, it went like that, and then I, I peeled the, I peeled its paper up, and then I trimmed it, okay? So that part was on, and this part was not. So I scrubbed this part, and then I peeled that little bit and trimmed it. So I didn't have an opportunity to shift the whole thing all at once or anything like that. So, okay, that's that's right. Thank you, Michelle, for that, and Lori for this. I am really pushing down on it to get this on. Um, 
And I mean, yeah, this, this kind of looks like, you know, a little bit of a hot mess, but it's okay. It's okay. It's a mushroom. Here we go. Here we go. And it's actually sticking down now. I'm just making sure. Oh, hold on. That peeled up a little bit. Okay. Here we go, y'all. Look at that. And I'm telling you, if you... If you feel it, you can tell it's a rub-on. It's this soft, it, it, it feels just so soft and so nice. And I love how the ink just happens to be almost like a halo around it, right? All right, let's get another little, another little piece here. I'm going to get another little piece. We're going to do, I think we're going to do this one down here. Yeah, let's do that. I'm going to turn it where y'all can see me cutting it out. Let's see. Here we go, and um, I hope you can see this. I think you can. Make sure I'm only cutting one. I don't wanna break a heart over here. You know, I think I might could leave that, that white sheet down. I don't know, I'm not gonna try it. No point. But y'all, if y'all wanna see some amazing crafting, Go to Lizzie and Aaron. Hey, Heather. Um, yeah, so I was just talking about planners, Heather. So Heather and I were talking about planners. And um, and I did. I went through my planners. And um, I, found, I found some that I have not been, uh, I have not been a good steward of, y'all. And um, I'm, I'm going to be working with my planner to see. Oh, I like that. That would be cute, but then I'm gonna want something over here. If you give a mouse a cookie, right? If you give a mouse a cookie, maybe I'll just put him right here. Yeah. Um. So yeah, I want to be a good steward of my blessings, and I mean it's a blessing to me to have crafting supplies and to have a place to, to craft and have loving, loving friends to craft with and to teach crafting. Um, Heather said, oh, hey, Dana. Heather said, hey, just got here, fell asleep, slept way too long. Y'all, I might be saying hi to y'all more than once because I'm, I'm really, I, it, it could happen. And I appreciate y'all coming back at three o'clock. Y'all, we had the mother of all storms. Well, no, probably the sister of all storms because the mother of all storms came a couple of years back. But um, y'all, it was it was lightning and thundering, and um, I've been camped out in the EBR, the emotional baggage room, um, what used to be called a rumpus room back in the day. And um, I, because Ninja Man, you know, he tested positive first, and then I tested positive. And I was like, oh boy. So I just went ahead and moved out here. And I love it because I, I had iron beds. I have two iron, iron beds out here. One of them's from, I don't know, 200 BC. Um, okay, not really, but it's an antique. And so am I. But anyway, um, I'm, I'm a vintage 1958 model. But I've been out here in the EBR, and I, I laid there throughout that storm, and I'm not going to lie. I loved it. Now, there was some lightning and some and a whole lot of thunder, and puppy dogs curled up with me because, you know, storms. But, um, but yeah, I, I was good to go. Now, I'm gently picking it up to make sure. I'm gently picking it up here to make sure that everybody is smushed down. And this second round, I definitely got, I got a feel for how hard to press down. Now that little bit right there came up just a wee bit. Oh, y'all, y'all. I mean, now look, if I had a paintbrush, I'd just go for any anybody coming in late, like this and they'll, and I'll be like, so I learned to paint, mm -hmm, yeah. Okay, do we want, we we want a little something here, like a verse. I mean, not, well, I'd love a verse. Man, if they would do Bible verses, I, I'd just be live from now on. 
I would be live from now on. I don't think there were any words in this one. Let's look in this one, because I know we had words here. I know we did. Let's look. See, like, like this. Um, Ennis Fallen Greenhouses. I, I don't think you're going to go there to buy your mushrooms. Um, I, I don't know. I don't know. All right, we're just going to keep looking. This is my favorite page. This and that deer and that bunny and the the skunk cousin um, sweat hog beaver thing. Um, ooh, Kathy Vernon, grass for the bottom of the mushrooms. Let's look for it. Let's look. I will look. Badger, that was it, the badger. Hold on. All right, come on now. Oh, y'all, I'm not finding any words I can use. All right, let's look for grass for the bottom of the, of the shrooms. You know, I could do this up one side a little bit. Let's see. Maybe just a little piece. Yeah, if we don't find, find grass, I'm going to come back and cut a piece of that. I am, I am. Let's see what they got. There he is, y'all. Right there. That's my little baby deer. And then that's my baby bird. Um, that's my hedgehog and my bunny. Y'all, I love this so much. I mean, like, I'm not even kidding. If somebody if somebody gave this to you as a gift, I mean, it would have to kind of go with your interior of your home, right? But I mean, isn't it pretty? Isn't it pretty enough to... Ooh, that would be pretty right there, I think. Nah. Ooh, these leaves, these leaves right here are a good bet right there. So we'll, we'll come back to that one. We're still looking for grass. See all the shrooms? And this, he's upside down. The bunny. Oh my goodness. And I love his face. I love his face. My friend Donna, her daughter, loves everything foxes. And this is her color. And I, I don't know. I might have to make something and send it to her. I might. You know, here's what's funny. If I have something that I know somebody I, I love and care about would want more than me, I have to give it to them, y'all. have to. I'm going back to the little, I think it was here. Yep, I'm going to this right here. I'm going to take it off and add it. And now I'm starting to really like my little, my little book cover thing, y'all. I was just doing mushrooms because I could. And I think it'd be sweet to have um, to have maybe the word recipes or something and turn this into a recipe file. As, assuming I know anyone, you know, who, well, I mean, I know a lot of people who cook, but I can't use it. <laughs> ah, I don't like to cook, y'all. I mean, here's a story, okay? My kids are 41 and 36, all right? And I cooked every day for 77 years. Not really. But I cooked and cooked. How about this? Um, how about this? Was it Sue? Who, who suggested? Hold on, hold on, hold on. Uh, Kathy Vernon. Uh, was it Kathy? Uh, yes, Kathy Vernon. What do you think of this for the bottom? I know that's not grass, but what do you think? Maybe just kind of... Put it like this. What do you think? What do you think? Uh-oh. Come here. Um, so cute. Hard to decide. Yes, Deborah. There's a tiny mushroom in the lower left that would look great. Ooh, ooh. Let me go back. Is that a fairy in the corner of the last page? Allow me to check that out and see. A fairy in the corner of the last page right here? No, it's a flower. It's a flower. And, um... Yes, okay, Kathy likes the leaves. All right, and Deborah said, tiny mushroom on the lower left. Oh, this one, Deborah? So cute. All right, let me hold on to that one, see if that's the right one, because there's not one there. She said lower left, uh-oh. Lower left, we're still on the correct, I think. Oh, come on. Y'all, I'm shaky because, you know, prednisone, steroids, 
I know. And it's like, no, don't do that. You should eat lettuce and vegetables and green juice. I know, I know, but there's nobody here taking care of us, so we're kind of on our own. Uh-oh, all right, all right. I think this is the one Deborah's talking about. Is this it, Deborah? Yes, okay. All righty, here we go. We might do the whole, we might do all of these. Let's see what we think. All right, here we go, here we go. Y'all, I love this. I, I think I've already said that, but I love this so much, so much. Let me see where we want it. Uh-oh, uh-oh, see, see what happens? We don't want that. We don't, we don't. All right, but I can see if we want it like that. And then put, I think we're going to have to just go with these. Let me see. I think I like this one like grouped in there. Yeah, yeah. I like it grouped in there. To me, it looks more natural. Let's do this. All right. So we're going to put that little one on. Thank you, Deborah. I love him. He's a cute one. Yes. Okay. We, yeah, we can just layer these guys, you know? Just layer them. Here we go. Here we go. Let's see. Y'all, I mean, it's just beautiful. And I'm probably going to be off the chain and go back and order more than I should. But, um... I've been I've been looking for stuff like this for years. Oh y'all, look at that! Ah, I love it. I love it. Great idea, Deborah. Okay, all right, here we go. I think. Yeah, leaves could have fallen on the ground. They could have fallen. Yeah, they need to go like this though, only because I don't have grass. But you know what? Now I know I need to go buy one of these with grass. I need to have some grass. There we go, right there. And this kind of an album, like I'm doing the um, the outside of it, right? The cover, okay? So the inside pages will need to be done with, you know, scrapbook paper and stamps and stuff like that. I won't do the whole album with these, but... I go back to miltonsdaughter.com and order more iron orchid designs, then I can find some teeny prints that I wasn't, you know, I, I wasn't I wasn't up on the whole what to buy kind of thing like I am now. But I'll tell you this, I definitely have a have a knack for how much pressure. I mean, put a lot a lot of pressure. That's a definite. When you're when you're using it on um, this kind of canvas like I am, I mean it's not hard, not hard at all. It's worth every minute. And y'all, my little jobby job that I have, my work phone has not rung, and I'm so happy because I'm not I'm not able to answer it when I'm crafting, right? And the lightning and thunder has stopped. Okay, these are actually in the pattern. Those little, these little spots right here. Ninja Man's in their coffin. And I think it would have been great if I had thought of this first and layer, put this down first and then layered that over that, right? But it is what it is. Um, just for fun, we could poke a strawberry there maybe. I don't know. I don't know. Isn't that pretty? Thank you, Deborah. Let's see. Um, oh, Michelle, you've got to go in November, girl. You got to go. And be sure and introduce yourself to me. Were you there last year? I can't remember. Um, Deborah, thank you. And Lisa, thank you. I love it, y'all. Um, so let me let me see. Okay. Um all I want to do now is, you know, 
I don't know. There, there's a lot of little finishing touches, you know, that you would do to an album like this. Um, I think I would put a different binding on it. I don't know. I don't know. It depends. And the edges, I'm probably going to distress, um, age. Let's use some brown real quick and see what we think. Let's see what we think with some brown. Um, just because we can, right? Oh, wait. Do I have some in my, in my chocolate container? Nope. Okay. If y'all, um, if y'all are just tuning in, come say hey. And also, um, you might want to go to the very first because, um, I got COVID and I showed all my little meds I'm on and Ninja Man has COVID. We have the crud, we have the cooties and, um, we're okay. We're okay. I mean, it's just like a bad cold. I think it, um, and the prednisone is making me, you know, shake a little bit. Oh, the lid just came right off of that one. There it goes. Okay. So this is the brown. This this could this could ruin everything. Let's see what happens. We're just gonna we're just gonna hit the edge a little bit, a little bit, just to make it look old. That's kind of what happened to me. All the edges are fraying. Everything looks old. <laughs> Ain't nothing where it used to be. <laughs> Ah, I tested positive for COVID, negative for patients. I mean, I'm just saying. I'm just saying. Okay. Yeah, so, um, y'all, I was telling Michelle Merriman she's got to be there in November. We are going to an event called Hickabilly Christmas. And that is, now see, I'm coming in just a little bit in the corners because I think I'm getting froggy. Um, we are... Uh, we're meeting up in Chattanooga for Hickab Hickabilly Christmas, and that is an event put on by Lizzie and Aaron. And I cannot wait. Last year, I did a comedy routine there. Oh, y'all. Okay, I mean, really, really, this is too stinking cute. So, yeah, I did a comedy routine last year. And, um... And I hope, I hope to do one again. I don't know. I didn't really know I was doing one last year. Or maybe I knew and forgot. Who knows? Y'all, look at that. We went from this to this. And I'm just in love with this craft. I am absolutely in love. Um, let's see, virtually. Okay, Michelle, okay. Kathy Vernon, maybe some brown along the bottom of the mushrooms. Ooh, let's do that. Let's do that. Just to kind of ground them, right? Right, Kathy? Um, give yourself grace. The steroids can be harsh. I know. I was on them for almost 10 years. Oh, my word. Girl, I don't want to be on them for 10 years. I'm just putting just, just a wee bit up under the bottoms. To kind of ground it, right? Now, I'd like, I'd like this. Okay, that was called tea dye, T-E-A, tea dye. My friend Angel will love that. This is milled lavender. I want to put, I wanted like a little gray, but this is right in front of me. So we're going to go with milled lavender and just add that. How about it? How about it? There we go. Y'all. Okay, so if I just do this for the next 21 years, will y'all forgive me? Because, um, you know, I love this. I love this. I love it all. I love it all. Let me move him back over here. There we go. I love it all. You guys are so sweet. Thank you for the hearts. Thank you for all the love. And, um, and please go over to my YouTube channel and subscribe um, it's the same name, Kathy Bohannon, Creatively Blessed. Um, I'm also about to um, start working on some other social media stuff. Um, I'm not even kidding, not even kidding. Um, it's, it's going to be like a full-time job. So, um, yeah. Guys, thank you so much. Um, Deborah, thank you. 
Thank you. I love you guys. I appreciate y'all. Um, keep us in your prayers. I mean, Tuesday night I was snorting and huffing and puffing, but today I'm great. And um, we just, you know, we're just puny, just a little puny, and we get tired real fast. But we kind of did that anyway, I think. I'm going to go wash this brush and um, and just kind of sit here and, and swoon over what is gorgeous. All right. Okay. Love you guys. Thank you so much. Love you, Deborah. Thank you, Lisa. God bless y'all. And toodles.